Alrighty, here we have uh, Checkers. Actually, specifically, it is uh, Checkers for Kids from Prison Games. So we've got uh, Play, Colors, Fish, and Toys. So we have toys here. This is where you can choose which um, which the toys you want to represent yourself in the game. Uh, you get two toys to begin with. You get the avocados and you get the, the raccoons. And then every other toy here is an eShop purchase. Now the game just came out. Um, and the DLC, which is the toy box, which allows you to get all these other toys, is $1.99 right now for the next, I think, couple days at least. Um, down from, I think it was like $3.99, $2.99. So a little bit of a discount there. And I'm going to go ahead and go back. All right. And you can come in here and you can do colors, which is kind of cool. So you can change the color of the uh, checkers board. You can pretty much do any, any color combination you want, which is kind of cool. So we'll do we'll do that one. That's fine. Okay. Actually, I think that was what it was before. Let's just change it up a little bit here. There we go. Okay. All right. And then you can go play. Actually, let's look at fish first. So fish. Now fish is supposedly a mini game. Um, however. I can't figure out what you can do with the fish because there's no buttons to do anything. Um, all, all I know is you can look at the fish. That's, that's awesome, right? Look at the fish. That's cool. There's no mini game for the fish that like it advertises in the eShop. Uh, if you know how to do it, let me know in the comments. I'd love to know because that's just... All I know is that it's just there for looks. All right. So let's play the game here. So here's where you choose the rules. So you can choose um, if uh, beatings can be made diagonally for or for diagonally forwards only, or beatings can be made diagonally forwards and backwards. Makes the game a little bit easier. Um, you've got uh, it's not compulsory to beat opponents' toys. It's compulsory to beat opponents' toys. The player chooses any sequence. And you have these options here. The king toy moves by one square and beats toys forwards backwards. King toy moves by any number of squares daily forwards or backwards after the beat. It lands directly behind the beaten toy. Or the king toy moves by any number of squares diagonally forwards or backwards and lands in any square behind the beaten toy. And you have these options here. If a toy reaches the last row during a beating or a normal move, it becomes a king toy and the round ends. A toy is crowned, it becomes king toy only if it finishes its move in the last row. If a toy reaches the last row during a beating move, it can continue this move as a king toy. So, cup, quite a bit of options there to choose from. And then once you choose your rules, you have the option to play uh, single player. You can play the game with one controller or one switch light if you're playing on switch light. Uh, or you can play with multiple controllers. If I had multiple controllers, it would let me select that, but I don't have any connected right now. And then here is where you choose who goes first. So the player one, player two, or random. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and choose single player. So play against the AI. And we're good to go. So pretty standard fare, uh, pretty standard game of checkers here. Why am I not able to? Oh, that's right, duh. I was thinking chess for some reason. It's not chess, it's checkers. <laughs> you want me up diagonally. So yeah, uh, like I said, pretty Pretty standard uh, game of checkers here. Uh, the game's cute. Uh, the game's really cute. I, I like the graphics. I like 
how it's aimed towards a younger audience. So um, if you got kids, it's a great game to play with your kids. Uh, if, you, if you don't have kids and you want a cute checkers game, this is definitely worth checking out, worth picking up, I think. I'm not very good at checkers, but it's still fun. <laughs> Um, I, I wish there was more toys to choose from that wasn't behind a paywall. Um, uh, I think maybe the ability to unlock the toys would be a, would be a better solution rather than having you pay the deals and pay a DLC cost. Um, but other than that, I mean, I really have nothing nothing negative to say about the game. Uh, I mean, it's checkers. <laughs> I hope <laughs> it's checkers. It's cute. It's fun. Um, it's enjoyable. And, yeah, it's just, just a blast to play. So, um, this is my very short review of, uh, <laughs> Checkers for Kids. Uh, again, definitely a game worth checking out. If you guys have kids, if you guys don't have kids and like Checkers, uh, this is a great, uh, a great Checkers game. So, um, I would thank Prison Games for the review opportunity of the game. The game's great. Um, it feels great, it looks great, plays great, and it's an overall uh, a pretty pretty good game. So I want to thank you for watching, thank you for subscribing. As always, till next time, <laughs> take care and happy gaming.